Hey everybody on YouTube land, we're out at the airport and today is Sunday, January 14th of 2018. Basically what I came out here for <clears throat> is to bring a few things um, and primarily what I'm going to be doing is probably helping Dr. Morris <clears throat> with the Taylor craft so I forget what we're gonna do I think we have to finish putting on a um, we have to put felt on one side of the the door <clears throat> one side of the door window well we had to put felt on the windows because the the um, bunch of medoodles <laughs> The slider windows were messed up. We had to replace them. They were plexiglass, so we replaced them with Lexan. And <clears throat> so we have to felt line the, the, the slider, the runner. And I believe we have to finish one. Let's see, we did one side, so he's going to put the, uh, we'll put the, uh, the Lexan in that. And then we got the prop, we got to put the prop on. I believe he has some degreaser, if I'm not mistaken. So we'll be putting degreaser all over the plane and washing it down to try to get some of this uh, settled crap off of it. Because it's been sitting an awful long time, many, many years. So it's got an oily film on it, basically, with dust and all kinds of stuff. So, so yeah, that's what I'm gonna do at the airport. For the most part today, that'll be my, my, my day out here. I might come in here and mess around a little bit with mine. I'm still debating. I just got a hold of Dennis Carley and asked him where to put the handle for the BRS, the Ballistic Recovery System. And he said I can either put it up here on the root tube or down by the seat somewhere. He said he likes it down by the seat. So I may do that because it's, I don't know. I'm thinking I'll have my hand, my left hand on the throttle. And if I put it somewhere around here, I don't know, I don't know. Hmm, decisions, decisions. Well, that's one thing that I have to do. Then, then once I decide that, then I can mount my switches because I'm holding off on that for right now because you know I don't know whether it's going to go on this side, this side, down here. So I'm kind of holding off a little bit on that. Then I drained my tank uh, because I filled it with water to get basic levels, which I'll show you real fast if I can get over here. I don't know if you can see them. There's increments right here. These are each gallons. Um, so yeah, it starts down here, and that's a gallon. Two gallons, three gallons, four gallons, five gallons. So five gallons would come up to here. The reason I have this thing so long is because I didn't know exactly how far that was going to come up. I could probably drop it down to here. I may, in fact, do that. So. But right now I have the cap off and I'm letting it air out. Um, but basically I flushed out the, the tank. Now what I gotta do is I gotta get the carburetor cables and the assembly for, for, for those. And I have to put them in a, a tub, like that yellow one down there underneath the plane actually. And pour some gas in it and put those fixtures in there and rinse them out because there's some uh, aluminum, <coughs> aluminum shavings in them. Now, the other thing that I was going to do, I'm possibly going to take these strut supports and the struts off, and I'm debating whether I should use yellow on the struts and the strut supports, <clears throat> or the blue, which I don't know if you can see it, you can barely see it. You may see the blue on the wheel chocks. That's this blue. 
So I'm debating on whether I should use the the blue or the yellow. I like the yellow because it's it's easily visible and so I'm still debating though. I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do. But for now, that's about all I'll report. Once Dr. Morris shows up, maybe I'll turn it back on and show you a little bit about the uh, the Taylor craft. Okay, everybody. Uh, what I'm going to do, let me just uh, reiterate, it's Sunday, January 14th of 2018. <coughs> what I'm going to do is, where's my little lamps? Here they are. I'm going to put these little lamps, they're LEDs, I'm going to put these in the front part of my wheel pants. Right, ar right around here. So they'll be pointing this way. So right now, <coughs> what I'm trying to do, carefully, because i got a lot of stuff like this around so I can bash my head in, I'm trying to get these guys off. This way I can drill them and then mount the, the light. Hopefully you can see this. Hey, Dr. Morris. No thanks to Santa Fe Railroad. Oh, really? Oh, Jesus. <laughs> I was wondering. You know, I, 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 I was about the 10th car in line, and, and this train went chuck, 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 by. It got about two car lengths past the intersection and stopped, which meant that the farms were still down and right, and they stayed down. Then they started back up. And decided to change their mind. I went forward a little bit and went out far enough that the, that the boom came up. It let about three cars through and then it came down again. And it was that way for a whole damn half hour. Oh no. I just. Oh gee. Uh, yeah, I'm just taking this thing off. I'm figuring I'm going to probably put my. See that little dot right there? Oh, thank you, sir. Thank you. Yeah, I'm going to put the thing oh, right yeah. where the little dot is. Oh yeah. And then I figure I'll run a straw up along here <clears throat> until about right here and then maybe punch a hole in the side yeah and then put one of those uh male female connectors so i can easily take it off while it's still on this way when i remove it i can remove it without having to worry about the wires mm. it'll just be a plug anyway the other thing sound like, like a deal yeah and the other thing on your little airplane I forgot to bring them, but I found a couple of carbon fibers that are about, I don't know how long, be just perfect. Oh, for that tube? Yeah. Oh, good. Okay. Awesome. Well, let's